I stream daily, almost daily on twitch.tv slash canister underscore mtg, so be sure to visit that if you would like to catch some of my live content. I don't think I want to keep this rewarded. Do I prefer a bounce on or a map? I think a map. Baby boy. This is not living end. I've been tricked, but still this hand looks better. Can you keep up? Rank one, nimble pool, fitter. Can you keep up, rank one? Upkeep stop was a legacy inclusion from the morning lantern league always like the stress that they're gonna moon you in a ride but then they don't and it's all good can you keep up in case of discard spells I prefer to play my Vala cute to making a construct Cranial Ram is a super cool card, NGL, yeah, some Cranial Ramming. Primeval Titan, oh no, they play two lands, fetch two Valakuts. Should be for 12, we live, it's okay. You can't even get Grief Scam, they'll need three discard spells. Grief Scam into Amulet Removal, but cannot even be Ungraft's Rampage. One short anyway, so they play two lands and they titan, get two Valakuts. That's 12. I don't know how, like, we ever were at a place that... where we thought that Scam is a bad matchup after posturing. Oh, but the hot fury, fury shmuri. It's like committing free cards to just power. Those so bargains chain chaining rings. It was a time when there were no board wipes against Magus in the 75. Yeah, but at first there wasn't even Magus because that was the even even earlier time when Scam also fought their favorite super well and he might have been dead by now. No, I would get hit twice by the Fury, I would then win. Seven mana, one one. Pathetic. It's got two bow masters. Makes sense. Anyway, I lose to that. I don't think so. I 
1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10. Alright. Do they ever play Terminate anymore? I always just try very hard to play around Terminate, but I think the average scum list plays roughly zero. Two, I believe. Holy guacamole, that's so many Terminates then. Good thing I'm playing around them. We never have it though, one terminate. Okay. Oh. I just cosplayed the moment of Boromir getting bowmastered. Daniel Ram card. Try looking in the spoiler section. Holy shit, it's not there. It was leaked. Oh, guacamole. Then you won't see it. Cranial Ram is. Chad, is cranial RAM better or worse than cranial plating? Discuss. Better, living weapon. Alright, but is... Terminate better than... Doomblade? I guess, like, this has different text. But Doomblade, but also Terminate? Lamao moves to 5 and puts Ragavan in front of my... Arboreal Grazer on turn one. What's next? Magus on three. I think I don't need to play the Bosejo. I don't have more lands in my hand. It's 
is weak to Magus, but Babel, holy shit. Finally, I got convinced to play my Boseju. Oh, yeah, I missed two damage. I could attack. Ah, oh, whatever. Three top village, werewolf pack leader. What a deck. I always wonder, how is it that, like, people end up building those decks? Like, what is the... How? So, any reason not to block here? Bolt. They live under a rock, but, like, still they know of the existence of werewolf pack leader and they come and build it k command what they return grief okay fair says says the person who summons practice in 2024 i guess So maybe not the best example. Maybe there was some minor value in having the Dryad in play. And Bosedru in my hand. They pitched not dead after all, so they will probably not dead after all again, no? Grief again, Moon, Shouldred. Solid. Holy shit, next turn, copy Shouldred. I get next six. When Fable and Amulet, that already happened. It's already been done. It's old news. Oh, I found a place for Kali of the cast. No, but both Atraxa and Grizzlebrand are angels and demons, respectively. You can play it in a Goraya deck. I haven't thought about it much, though. Do -do -do -do. Do 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 I am glad I have Mulgand. Could you put back Dryad? Could put back Bosejo too. I think Dryad does less. Meticulous Archive Mill over Ischion of Draco. Hallowed Fountain, Sign of Draco, nice. Good deck building. So, I guess I do not copy Saga. 
Instead, I'll play the Zuva copy forest next turn. And I'll have all four amulets in play, and... That's a turn three titan. <sighs> what is this? Ardent play, okay, that's what it is. Crashing footfalls. I get it now. So I need the fourth amulet. And it is awkward that they have sub, I don't have mana next turn, but doesn't seem like they do. I guess Grolter was better, yeah. Yeah, they should have definitely grew turfed. We grew turfed anyways. Am I going to get the Miku Azusa? No, I don't buy secret lair cards. Also, I really dislike the artwork on that. It seems really weird. I would never rip off Amulet Titan from some, someone. Cog damage? No, don't cog damage me, please.
All right, no cogs were damaged during the recording of this game. Holy shit, I even have a Storm's Wrath with me today. That's convenient. Any defense greed and an engineer explosives. Holy guacamole. We somehow have all the cars needed for the Rhino men's. Roxan for Magus. They play Arden play. Are they not going to play Magus? Will they? Do I agree with Spike that the Raptor is insane and fucked up? I don't think he said that. It's like the value... I mean, if you can cast cards that cost more mana than one, than two with it, then those sound pretty solid. No frag task. I've thought about Tractors a little bit, but I don't think it matches up particularly well against Rhinos. But yeah, like, if you play it as a value card without trying to abuse it, then it's 2 mana... 2-1 two Cascade. It's like decent 2 drop value, 2 drop probably. But likely nothing crazy. But clearly it's an uncommon, so it's not supposed to be a constructed playable, so... Probably isn't. The Raptor is a trap. Hitting a dead removal or counter is terrible. Could be. He's a phenomenal control I guess player. if I went the other way around, I could amulet. Fetch the land, play. The district for a surveil. Now I missed out on a surveil. Do I think people will play the new Strix Serenade versus Amulet? I think it's not outside of the realm of possibility they would oh i have amulet i didn't realize that for a moment i forgot that i had it they're pitching anyway, so it doesn't matter. But they clearly didn't have Force of Negation last turn. But I could have Subtlety. So my first plan was to go Gruel Turf, then Bounce it replayed as Valakut, shoot, 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 but in that case I should have shot Rhino. Replayed once again, shot Rhino again, shoot Rhino again, but... Even if they sub and top deck sub, I think I'm fine. I think I still win. Maybe not. Ta -da -da. What's your retaliation, villain? <clears throat> also, Charlie, stage one, thank you very much for two months and a bit more of subscribing to my channel. One month in a row. Impressive streak. 
Titan Resolves. Ok. Will they cast a free mana form? No, they will not. They're getting protection. And I think odds are that I'll win this game. Pots? Ice. Hmm, Ice E. Is Bro gonna brosage my T West? That's neat. Or taint binder my Nope. So maybe we get Titan and not Colossus. In case of tight binder. Uh, without green for turn to explore, the hand is much weaker than it would have been. But I believe that the top of my deck can yield something good sometimes. And Saga would be pretty good too. Amulet, Grazer. And then green. So like I have many good draws here, I think. Good enough to keep against scam. Let's actually like calculate. Already made my play, but I'm happy drawing seven nineteen cards that I'm happy to draw. Explore not being one of them, but is it Misty Pass? That's fine. So Misty could Misty Pass could be Living End, which is also I think in John Julio's range, right? Hi, Kani. Are you still the best amulet player in the world? That depends, but probably. I mean, who else? Got griefed. I think the game just drifted into the territory of being unwinnable instead of being very winnable. Because he also milled over a waker. It's all very solid. But I guess the best I can do is this. Holy shit, I can't believe that villain had Erden player. Two wakers, that's two seven sevens, that is very big. Sherem, Sherem, Pięć, Osiem, Dziewięć. Guess technically, I can win with a Colossus or Chaining Rings by Chumblock.
I don't know if I should play a land here or not. Too hard for me to determine, so I just did. Worst case, I lose, so no problem. Urza's Saga. Let's go 61, Nutty Bog, one time. Holy shit, that's a Nutty Bog indeed. Now let's see if it's good enough. Because <laughs> the hand is maybe not so good besides all, all of that, all of the Nutty Bog situation. In it, it's kind of weak, but we have bog, we have time to draw. Yeah, I was supposed to play the defense grid, but I almost forgot. Fondue Broker. No, I actually wanted it to happen. Bojuka Bog. Bojuka Bog. Bojuka Bog. Bo -bo -bo Boduka Bog Boduka Bobo Bog Good pack for frag task. Thoughts? Dismiss. Then I'll die to living end. Problem is that Bojuka Bog actually didn't do anything because my point will reanimate 10,000 power anyways. Oh, Waker, Mill Waker again. Bog. All right, Nutty Bog didn't do anything. Hey, funny. I could cycle it, draw into a ring, but I was mentally distraught by how this game went bad. And mulligan it. Oh, this hand is very nice. Good back Foresta. Any chance I would like to keep Forest over the second vestige? No, I don't. I want to 
do it like this. This way I can go Saga. Holy shit, that's like the uh, once in a lifetime hand. But I get to go Amulet and I got, get to go Vestige Explore Construct. And then I get to do a Construct on turn 3 too. Although now we have to think about it. If I play Amulet, Vestige, I have 3 mana, I explore. So maybe it is better not to make a Construct anymore. No, if I draw a Bounce Land, I'll sell a combo. We can do it like this and then see what we draw with the first Explore and then save the second one, get Mob next turn. Well, also making Construct this turn. What do I think about a lot of people cutting the kill lands in Amulet? A lot of people, I have not seen lists like that. Do you have any any lists to link? This one has Oran Reef. This one has Slayer Stronghold and Vesuva. This one has nothing. I mean, I think it's valuable to run the first one. No nie, no co ty mi zrobiłeś? Zabrałeś się Tana? Oddawaj. Dobra, Tytan, Srytan i tak wygrywamy. I am a growth chamber. <clears throat> were there moments where crumbling vestige felt like a liability? Occasionally. Sometimes it does not produce permagreen and that could be like a bit awkward, but that's rare. I recently added the third one. And I've been enjoying it. I think it makes for better opening hands. More so than... You know, much, much more than... Than it is liable... Than it's a liability. <clears throat> I will copy Titan with Mirror Pool. I'll copy Titan and I'll kill. Holy shit, Scum is such a good matchup. Hmm. 
Like they don't really have game. Game one. I am a storm that is approaching. Twitch chatting. Yes, we won game one. I guess the board is stuck in the drafting portion. Holy shit, I need to restart mode. The lag is incredible. Let's do it right now. Keep a bit stinky this time, but high upside if I draw forest. No one drop. That's crazy, man. Can get moons then. Oh. Oh, oh, oh. Middle over a Voidwalker. That suggests that they have Voidwalker. Keeping the TS for Doffy. Could be, but... Could be. Maybe they really wanted to surveil. Lilian of the Veil entered the Exile Zone. Holy guacamole. Oh my god. How can you kill a god? An intoxicating existence. Too titan, really. I was really scared of them summoning the ring with Void Ogre. What if they break the Diost itself so that it could extend Vintage Cube with what he sees approval for the outage? You know, now that you say that, it just sounds really, really likely. So I'll be more scared if they cast the ring than a Titan. I mean, Titan is a bit scary too. But... Come on, sweet Nerevar, pass priority. Thanks. I'll put what I want to play, I'll... Use it to bounce Titan eventually, but first I'll... Chill behind rings. If possible. Whoops, keep the attack up spot game. Block. Saving three life seems good. Fable of the mirror bracker. That's a crazy card.
Chad, do you think I'll, I'll get them this game? I just received a phone call from my grandma. She wished me happy birthday for my birthday, which occurred yesterday. <clears throat> now getting blood crypts I want to fetch out the crypts with the fetches to deck thin could be ay 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 blood moon Not casting the ring though. It's so like now that it's it's even more surprising that they did just didn't fetch the blood creeps with their fetch lands to thin. I guess maybe it's not surprising, it's just something that they didn't think about, but <clears throat> they probably should do that. They can now do something not nice, like summoning a copy of Voidwalker getting a ring into play. I don't know why they didn't get the ring last turn, and like now they're so happy to do that, but... Fair. Well, Vulan has four blood crits left for <clears throat> four one, so they do have lands, yeah. What a silly game this has turned into. Yeah, you can indeed attack through protection, nothing preventing you from doing that. I think I can, like, not play the ring now. I don't know, like, what's in their hands. Uh, they have to have something. Kind of shameful to miss land drops in a spot like this, though. Like, I don't have the second land drop from Dryad. <clears throat> And the route to victory would be to draw with ring into Boseju, Boseju Moon, draw Bounce Land, Bounce Land, Pow Pow win. Void Walker, oh no. Black, off of a treasure, Fault sees me, oh no. Takes my ring. It's kind of a reason to just play ring last turn. Because I can fire spell later and it's kind of prolongs the game in a similar way. Push dryad makes sense. Five mana? Here that Sugu comes. Oh no. That's a problem. I think we are pretty dead this game. Now, I 
Oh no, my Vesuva. Is Dryad Arbor Mountain? No, it's a forest. <clears throat> if Blood was in play, then it had a ruling, which I do not remember what it was exactly, so unfortunately I can't tell you. It becomes a land creature, mountain dryad. What you're saying is crazy. But likely true. Is better Thrag than Wormcall against Scam? Question mark. I in fact think that Thrag Task is better than Wormcall, yeah. And more so than against Scam, I think Wormcall is kind of a blank card against you, while Thrag Task is a pretty good one. This is a keep. If I draw a bounce land, we can summon a Titan pretty early. I have Bosseju for Moon, Forest. Pitching Foxy, so are we getting Grief Scound? Well, likely. <coughs> Taking two packs, fair. I'll play a land so that I can top deck the Onion Ring. Easily. Classic Scam 1 land there. I think attacking for 2 with the Wolf Run is really not worth it if my opponent like draws red and dashes Ragavan, that's worse for me. Right chat, fire spout ring, Guru turf. Now it's awkward because I'll have only the five life points. What size there? Let's go. No foot size there. Ragavan. Dryados. I'll die to his camp spell. Well, not quite dead to push just yet, so not, let's not scoop. The villain has three and a half spell in hand, so <clears throat> it's a little bit of an issue. Well, I could have dealt five damage, but villain also would have dashed Ragavan. Holy shit, that's Fractusk. Geal their own grief after combat. Let's hope they won't geal it. No geeling. No attacks. Holy shit, I'm winning. Pro just lost to Fractus for the Curious. Situation.
Now imagine if this was a Wormcall engine. I guess it would be the same. Not the first person to lose to Fractus, but perhaps to last. Well, I'm not cutting it. Let me tell you. Bro lost to Thraktask. Kicks D. Well, of course they're still playing. Maybe they can find a way to unlose, but I don't like their chances. Classic scam for its worth. Fable, Blood Moon, Magus, Hidetsugu, What's his grief? That was their hand, I'm guessing. Do I trust my commercial district this much? I don't think so. Moro bug? When could be on scam or on mono black last in my probably on scam turn two monkey mr stream around started thank you i really appreciate it can draw we can play a ring if i draw it Lillian of the Veil. Oh no. <clears throat> Seems like I can't possibly keep my pact in my hand. Explore is gone. <sighs> Any cards so far in MH3 that you think will be good in Titan? So far I've just seen Flare of Cultivation. I don't think Flare is gonna fit too well into Titan as it is, so... I don't know if it fits the criteria even. <clears throat> but yeah, not really. The new green land is cool, but... I guess I do have Delirium at this very moment, right? But I guess nothing worth copying. You rebuild the deck and you play Aftermath Analyst. You mill yourself, get Delirium, that's maybe pretty cool. What about the MDFC so you can pack for a land? Yeah, I think I'll probably play it, but I think it's pretty low value. One one ETB Explorer. There is a one one ETB Explorer. C not Scout is the name. One one draw a card, you can play another land this turn. Holy fuck, for oh, green mana? That's crazy. Then I could play eight explorers in Titan. This Titan was a pretty, pretty good draw. Not unhappy to have 
found one. Alright, Binu. Make your move. Seeming growth chamber. Reap. Dracus theater. Rough times, Broski. Cold red or grief? Cast away in school. <clears throat> he really does. Dawaj requestu jeszcze raz. Jaki to był chwytak? Chwytak co? Ma wpisać. Holy shit, wait, tantalizing hand. Oj, 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 oj. I mean, it's only reasonable to mulgan it. Ale gówno. At least I'm resistant to grief scam. Kinda. Holy shit, no play, that's crazy. But it's actually no play. Or does he have like wait till end step? No, no play. Huh. So I suspect Moon. Moonister. Fable. Yeah, Pierdole, yeah. Zachwop. What is this end? Potsy's pass fable, really? This card shouldered. I guess you have more shouldered. Storm dropping his shoulder, it awkward. Lots of scam today. Good thing it's a great matchup. Oh, let's just draw Titan and win. Copy. Nine mana, yeah, that's good. Is it a good matchup nowadays? I think so. Scassic Wolfram is in my hand. Is that an issue? This.
Prague task is a 2016. Prague task is awesome. Do not slander Prague task. Nice survival, by the way. Bro, oh, Sfractask is giga optimal. What are you talking about? Unfortunately, Wolfram in my hand, but no way for me to deploy it, so we have to be trying to survive the turn. Which means I die to Moon. Okay, what? Guess that means a combat trick. And villain just wants to see through new cards, maybe two combat tricks because they want to use it on shoulder too. Which is fair. I did see the woodlands. Should the aura trigger or is it a model only feature? I never know. Beware of Blood Moon. Holy shit, I'm bewaring so hard. Right now. I'm bewaring like no one has bewared earlier. Villain, villain, villain. How many matches are you playing at once? Toxic Delusion is reprinted, holy shit. Famous Terminator is also lethal. Are you sure about that? We're gonna have a food token in play. Which we can crack in the unkeep. In response to the ringster. Why is the opponent's saga tapped? It came back from not dead after all. <clears throat> Was it the same game where you had a good 7 and they did turn 2 nothing, turn 3 fable? No, I didn't have a good 7. I had like a 6 with 1 spell, which they thought ceased. It would go Fotsy's Fable into Shoulder, so... Yeah. I think my point was is being proven, whatever it was, as we speak.
Nice. I apologize for disrupting your watch party. He's a phenomenal control player. Hello. Well, put help MPG. Let's hope we can actually do the thing you described, though, as no guarantee. It's seven rounds. Also, piano proiet pro piano proietivo. Thank you. The sub. Sushi paradise. I think villain was watching too, though. It's better not currently showing up. Am I locked on only free grazer? Yeah, actually. I think the overall smoothness of the deck has improved. Ever since I went with this 4 explore free free build, it feels like my hands are clanked much less often. Well, maybe not much, but significantly less often. I think the the grazers You know, this just smooths, smooths everything out. Not playing this many grazers, playing other cards instead. Sweet Spear, holy shit, that's prowess. My hand is... Ah, uh, turn for ring, like, it's not too bad against prowess. Although, it might be a bit bad on the draw. Okay, draw amulet. No. Slick shot show off. Slick shot show off. Yeah, I also greatly enjoy playing those. Ay, 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 oh, curva, my hand is not going, not developing particularly well here. But yeah, I don't miss Sun Home at all. Hammer is great. Flexible, cheaper. I enjoy my wolf run. I think it has enough value to be worth playing. Like for the most part, if you have double amulet, you win. That isn't. What well, should they plot it? A show off? How come? Holy shit, what a powerful play. I play Explore, I play Top Land. Well, Coral is Untapped Land. How come they suspended the show off? I guess it doesn't make a difference, it's one damage this turn, so. Makes sense they did actually. Well, it doesn't take much to kill me. Lava Dart. I accept the loss. I don't know if I should have fire storms rough against those decks. Explosives. What is spelunking coming here? Uh, what is spelunking for? For when your opponent disrupts you with disenchants, and that's what they do. No cat girl. Well, they don't play Magus mostly, so I don't think she matches up well against the Lightning Bolt aggro deck. Pouring out Grazer and beating Force of Vigor. 
Yeah, and they don't have force of vigor, but they have various other disenchants. Maybe holding amulet is actually better, but like I can't replay really Taplan this turn, so but it's possible I'm supposed to hold amulet and then literally not play it to play turn to explore through pick your poison which they're casting right now. It's probably true because now I mean like they don't get a one drop, but it makes sense because of vaults, yeah. I mean, five mana shock bolt is not. This is just not good. Thank to bolt. The cat girl seems pretty obviously stinky. What food is unacceptable to eat with a fork? I think you should. Eat with what you find comfortable. Although, is it acceptable to eat soup with fork? Well, it's certainly pretty hard. Have I played any Pioneer recently? Not much. Favorite pierogi feeling? Pierogi. Scash from his watch game. Would I still play Lotus in Pioneer? After the PT, I swore to never play a combo deck in Pioneer ever again or something like that so I unfortunately I can't holy shit 9 power no pierogi z kaszą boczkiem zajebiste takie Tak, tak sprzedałem jako pierogi chłopskie czy coś. Well, I failed to requalify the PT. I went 5 5 reconstructed. I did throw a few games and all that jazz, but. I think the lot is like. It's, it's kind of broken and kind of sucks, but it kind of more, more so sucks. I hope what I'm saying is useful. And insightful. Holy shit, delay. All right, brother, you got me. Seems like we're losing against prowess. It also hard counters. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8. Well, they need other spell. They have land in hand and draw land and we're good. But it hard counters the... I think, I think that kills me. Okay, that definitely kills me. But yeah, delay, hard counter to fire spout, finally. When it comes off of suspend, it still doesn't work. That is fucked up. Seems like we're not operating, but there is still one more round in. House of Mana, MTG. On the draw. In the mirror, I don't think this is gonna do it. Keeping this. Woodland in New York, very nice. Yeah, it makes more sense. He's a phenomenal control player. Whoops. Does York get Delirium? Probably more so than Titan. But not obvious and yeah, I don't know. If you play Flare of Cultivation where you can get Delirium more consistent, 
But like in Titan, you can't really do that without like overflowing everything. Holy shit, he's doing the same things but better. Although I'm very glad that he deployed a sealing growth chamber. Flare and Yogg Moth. Flare is so weird, it's... Interesting. What are you next turn? Pretty dead. Unless I'm not... And I find Brosejo. The upside of the land is pretty high, yeah. I imagine. Alright, next turn I'm gonna show him. It's just making some constructs, right? He doesn't have a Titan. Hmm, or maybe. Hmm... I see... Ay ay ay... Ay ay ay... You don't know, maybe they had five grazers. True. I don't know. Hmm. Interesting. I mean, I have eight bounce lands, so... One in eight, eight in 53. So 53, if you divide that by eight chat, then you have... Six eights there, seven eight eight, seven eight, one and seven. Odds are not on my side, I think. In fact, they are at thirty percent. So it's Morgan. This is worse. Saga Saga, then try bounce land anyways, I guess. Let's do what kind of works if they play bounce. Yeah, a tiny bit. Holy shit, I am getting outskilled extremely hard right now. Yeah, my hair is pretty anime today. I guess, in a way. Pretty animistic.
Saving Explore for the next turn. Tovara can bounce through the saga, it's because. Hey, holy shit. It really can. It really can. Yeah, it lists out the type for some reason. I guess the reason being specifically to bounce Urza Saga. I think uh, I currently have no outs. There is not one of them. Holy shit, this Primeval Titan deck is very good. So, about those spoilers. Again, what's the deal with the Eladam with Eladamiri's name? Korvek Dal? Super Elvish Peeper. Holy shit, I got an answer. His title, Korvek Dal, is a reference to the Rathi tribes, the Kor, the Vek, and the Dal. Korvek Dal, holy shit! The Korvek Dal was prophesied to unite the tribes against the Envicar Volra. Holy shit, thank you for the explanation. Korvek Dal. Wait, the tribes, the Kor? I thought the Kors were a race. Ilkor, Dal, Accomplished Alchemist. In the syllabi, Dal doesn't even show up in Accomplished Alchemist, so it's interesting. The Alchemist? That is fucked up. I think you're probably an Oscoop. Alright. I guess we get to witness a little bit of much fixing chat. Clearly paid actor, tightens me on turn 3 with perfect hands twice, but somehow I still end up victorious.